A Gwinnett County Ballet Company says it's out nearly $20,000 after two of its trailers were stolen. And it was all caught on camera. Those trailers contain props, costumes, and other essentials needed for its production of the Nutcracker. Uh, Fox News' Eric Perry has more on that Christmas nightmare. Jennifer Gordon says the men cut a hole in the chain link fence and drove off with one of the trailers. She wants to know how anyone could be that cruel. It's a little scary that our community is experiencing the little crime wave. This surveillance video shows the moments thieves forced their way into the property at the Northeast Atlanta Ballet Company and took off with a trailer filled with thousands of dollars worth of goods needed for the Nutcracker. Come around here, you can see where they cut through our fence. And I mean, it's a really steep hill, so it wasn't an easy job for them, that's for sure. But you can see it's a pretty large hole they cut out and they parked down at the bottom of the hill here. Artistic director for the Gwinnett Company, Jennifer Gordon, says in her 30 years with the company, Monday's break-in and theft is a first. They then cut into not just the, the padlocks, but actually cut through the locking mechanism of the first trailer, um, opened it, and they emptied out nearly all the contents. They weren't done. A couple hours later, we see on video where they come around with the same truck, they back into the parking spot, and they l hook up the big trailer, the 20-foot trailer, and haul it away. Inside, props, costumes, thousands of dollars worth of furniture, including a backdrop, all gone. The next morning, a Christmas miracle. Got a call about 9.45 on Tuesday morning from the Gwinnett County Police saying that our trailer had been found in a church parking lot and that all of our contents of the trailer was strewn about. These pictures show the mess found at another church off Duluth Highway. The trailer stuck in the mud. The company's surveillance cameras will get an upgrade in case they come back. Worries me that they might come back and, and try to hit the church. So that's why we're being a little more vigilant, getting more cameras up so we can protect each other. Thankfully, the production of the Nutcracker is already concluded for this year, so they have about 10 months to get ready for next year's production. If you want to help and donate, we've put more information on our website. Eric Perry, Fox 5 News. Eric, thank you.